What is going on y'all? It is Ranger Marcus or Marcus Rareman and today we have a very cool video. We will be looking for the California Tiger Salamander and the Western Spadefoot Toad. We are going to be looking through some ponds, we are going to be road cruising while it is raining at night. And we're going to be doing this with Neo and Ferris. So I'm driving to the Bay Area right now, I'll be listening to the new SZA album. Let's get it. All right, y'all, we are out at the spot. Neo and Ferris will be here in a couple minutes and we are gonna be looking for the tiger salamanders. It is not raining yet, but it will rain in the next hour or so. So hopefully we can find some salamanders. Let's go. And the first herp of the night, we have a Western toad. And the second Western toad of the night. Starting to sprinkle now. And the third toad of the night. I don't know. It's only been about five minutes or so. And the fourth toad of the night, it is getting insane so far. We have found four in the first, I don't know, five minutes or so. So after five, I'll probably stop recording these guys. Neo spotted the next one. This is the fifth toad. I am gonna be done recording these guys. And then uh, at the end, I'll say how many toads that we found. All right guys, Neo just found the very first one. This is a California tiger salamander. Look at this cool thing. I'm gonna get lots of video, lots of pictures, and hopefully we can find some more. We got another guy right here, and we got a pretty white individual right here. So uh, Neil found another one as well. So we have four now, just in this small little pond. Oh, found another. Neil just found two more, that is six now. So we have found six tiger salamanders. Look at this guy. This one has the super white coloration. So you can hear them in the background. They keep finding them. We found like nine to 10 already, but look at this guy. So this is the California tiger salamander. It is an endangered species here in California. I'm pretty sure they may be, they may be federally listed, but they are for sure um, endangered here in California. So the reason for this um, is because their populations are dwindling. So that's why I'm not picking these guys up. Uh, I'm not allowed to pick these guys up or else I would be giving you um, some really good looks. But yeah, but look at this guy crawling just through the reeds here. So Neo is killing it on the spots. Here's an arboreal salamander, our first one so far. And he's dashing away. So it is very difficult to get pictures of these guys because they move a lot and, uh, you know, we can't touch them. But you can see this guy just trying to chill right there. It's kind of cool angle there. Look at this guy crawling down here. This one's a fairly good size one. All of them have actually been fairly good size. I mean, this one, you can see how big it is. About as big as my hand, six, seven inches or so. It's a cool individual. It's starting to really come down now. Rain's coming down. This is, uh, what, number 14? And then Ferris just found another one, so we got 15 now. Yeah, so this is kind of getting insane. And what's crazy is that this was supposed to be a pond, but it's actually a dried up pond. So there's no water in it. So these guys have been without water now for, I don't know, months now. But they are still thriving because we have found, I think, 16 in this dried up pond. Absolutely insane. So they just found number 20. So we found 20 of these guys now. I mean, these are the coolest, the coolest salamanders. My favorite is still the Sierra Nevada Encina, as you guys know, but these guys are so cool. You can see how hard it is to kind of see these guys, because he is way down in this burrow. Like you can barely even see him in there. See, and the coolest part is that these guys are so bright that I have, you know, just this little rinky dink lamp here. Oh, oh, red-legged frog. Red frog. Well, they just got a red-legged frog over there. Look at this. This guy just walking around, just chilling in the rain. We have two red legged frogs right here. There is one. Pretty cool. Where's the next one? Up here. Second guy. We got two tigers right here, one's right here. Where did that other guy go? And right there. So we have found 26 
California tiger salamanders. An insane amount, way more than we thought we were going to. Maybe four or five. So we are gonna go walk around in a different place and go cruise afterwards. But right here we found 29 California tiger salamanders, two red-legged frogs, 14 toads, and then uh, two tree frogs. Forgot to film one of these guys, but this is a little, this is, I mean, I guess Pacific tree frog on this side, yeah. Or Sierra and tree frog, one of the two. So we started cruising and we got our first tiger on road. On the way to the spot. On the way to our next spot, crazy. This one has very little patterning on the dorsal side there, but cool nonetheless. First tiger on the road. All right, y'all, so we just found a Western Spadefoot. They are super cool looking toads. We just cruised them, it's raining out here. Uh, this is gonna be our last find of the night, but we are gonna get lots of pictures of this guy, but look at these crazy eyeballs. I mean, they are just bulging right out of them. Super cool species though, gonna take some pictures. All right, so this is gonna be our last toad of the night, our last frog, look at this guy hopping away. All right, guys, that is gonna do it for me here today. We had an awesome time with Neo and Ferris. We found over 30 tiger salamanders. I think it was like 32, and that was the number one target. It was a lifer for me. We also found one Western Spainfoot, which was the second target of the night. We found one arboreal salamander, a couple of red-legged frogs, and a couple of tree frogs. I'm going to put Neo and Ferris's socials in the description. But if you guys made it this far in the video, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and thanks for watching. Peace.